Welcome back to the Mind of Widge YouTube channel. My name is Widge and today I wanted to talk a little bit about deployment bags and why I think they're important for rockets that are bigger or have complex parachutes. So this is a deployment bag that I designed. I, I sewed it and cut it out of Nomex, which is a flame resistant fabric. And it's pretty simple. It has a main part right here for the canopy to go in. And then it has a little secret, little tab up here, a little flap that you tuck the shroud lights into that keeps everything separate and allows it to come out uniform and very straight. So I'm gonna do a couple demonstrations on how I pack it and how it actually unfolds out of the bag. Okay, so this is how I pack this parachute. This parachute is a six foot disc gap band parachute that I had custom made for this rocket. Very straightforward. What you do is you just kind of bunch up the fabric on the top part of this parachute, like so. And you just, just cram it up into the, the top of the deployment bag as nice and tight as you can get it. And there's no need to be careful or, you know, get all the gores in line because the way that this deploys inherently it lets everything come out in order and under tension which i think is a very important aspect of why deployment bags make parachute deployments much more reliable so now you can see we have the fabric part of the chute all tucked into the deployment bag so what we're going to do now is take these shroud lines like this we're going to walk them back and forth and make two sets of bunched up shroud lines. So that's about good. We'll take them, kind of open this flap a little bit, and you put them up into this flap here. And you just kind of tuck them back up in there, pull the fabric over it, and now that first set is secured. We'll take the remainder of the shroud lines and do the exact same thing. I'll just tuck these first ones in a little bit more, and then we'll take the second batch and we will tuck them in right in front of the first batch. And then what's left is your leader. So this is the lead to the main shock cord. This will go to your avionics bay or whatever your main tether is to the, to the rocket. So this just kind of stays up in here like this. I kind of just fold this a little bit, keep this leader here. And then these flaps, they don't secure to anything. They're just kind of a little extra layer of protection on there. But what's different about this deployment bag that I made rather than ones that you normally buy is that it has this loop and it has this pin up here. So what this does is it allows you to close the deployment bag and you run this little loop through this uh, eyelet and it pokes out. And then I have sewed a pull pin right here onto the Kevlar leader. And that pull pin inserts through this loop and it tucks into this little flap here. So now we have a tightly packed deployment bag that's ready to be inserted into the rocket. You have your loop for your pilot chute right here. And I'm gonna show you how this pin works in action. And I'm gonna show you how, I'm gonna show, it's gonna, we're gonna deploy, we're. This pin setup that I designed, why I love it so much is that when this is in the rocket, it's very secure, nothing's gonna happen. And until, it, when it deploys, this all, the bag all stays together. The pilot chute, which is right here, attaches to here. So this gets shot out of the rocket. The pilot chute deploys. Tension is put on this leader. And what happens is when this leader pulls, this pin slides right out of here, boom. And then it starts pulling everything out. And as this unfolds, the parachute comes out nice and organized. And we're gonna do some drop tests to show you exactly how this works in real time. Pilot chute in my hand. This is the rocket. So as I throw this, it's gonna act like the pilot chute is putting tension on the deployment bag and you're gonna see how everything unfolds. Three, two, one. Thank you. 
And if you've made it this far, I very much appreciate it. I hope I fulfilled all of your deployment bag and parachute needs, and I will be back soon with more content. Thanks for watching.